Welcome to my channel. If you're new, my name is Michelle. And if you're returning, welcome back. I want to come and share some new releases from Glossier with you guys. They've come out with a couple of new items and I haven't been here to kind of talk about all of them with you. For those of you who don't know, I'm a rep for Glossier, so I enjoy coming and sharing their products with you guys and they've released some new stuff so I wanted to come and share them with you. I believe it was last year that I did a video on the cloud paint which is Glossier's liquid blush. Now for those of you who don't know about the brand, Glossier is a skincare and makeup brand and they're really big on you looking like yourself and your makeup kind of just looking like skin. They go right along with that saying your skin but better that's the kind of makeup they like to have so they don't ever want the makeup to look too dramatic or too shiny or over the top but just like a natural glow i came last year and shared their cloud paint with you guys and their cloud paint is a liquid blush i know for me liquid blush looks a lot more natural on my skin than powdered blush looks because you can just kind of let it seep in your skin and it looks like a natural flush and you can just easily intensify the color or have it look super super subtle so these are the two colors they're really nice warm colors this reddish looking one is in storm and this orangey one is in dawn i'm gonna go ahead and show you what it looks like swatched on my hand this one is storm it's a really beautiful like deep burgundy brown color and this is what it looks like just on the skin and rubbed in i didn't use that much but you can see how natural it kind of looks just sitting on the skin i'm in love with this color i always gravitate towards blushes that are very deep with a little bit of like a brown undertone and this is exactly that and i feel like it's just so versatile for daytime nighttime summer fall it's just a beautiful color and this one is in dawn and it's a burnt orange it's not a bright bright orange it's much deeper than their other orange color and i use a little bit more as you can see on this swatch you can see how intense it can look if you choose to use a lot more i'm in love with these shades i'm gonna use a beauty blender to kind of just tap it in the skin and give you guys a demonstration of what it looks like have a deeper complexion I think that these colors are probably the most natural flush of blush that you can get on your skin so I love 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 these and the second thing I wanted to share with you is the mascara and it's a pretty little pink bottle and the bristles in the mascara are super incy bincy tiny 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 
to be able to grab every little eyelash that you have. When I first, first got introduced to Glossier and I was buying everything on the website, I was pretty surprised that they didn't have a mascara. So for me, it's like, it's about time. I like this mascara as an everyday mascara. The bristles are so super, super little and thin that it's not made, in my opinion, for like a super dramatic lash. It's for your everyday makeup look, like literally your everyday, just running to the store makeup look. You just throw it on, it's so easy, and it grasps every single hair, so there's no clumping, there's no messiness with this. This is one thing I really like about it. The wand is super sturdy, and it does really just grab each lash. I love this the most for my bottom lashes even if I'm getting glammed up I'll just take it and just kind of like work it through the bottom lashes because the bristles are super thin it really elongates it and it darkens it and it just makes my makeup look so much better and I don't have to worry about it smearing because of the way that the brush picks up the lashes and one thing I love about it is that it doesn't make my lashes hard there are some mascaras I use where I feel like my lashes are so freaking hard when I touch them, but my lashes are still really soft and defined just enough for like an everyday look. And I don't have a whole crazy full set of eyelashes like I used to when I was younger, but if I'm not wearing false lashes, I'm definitely putting mascara on my own eyelashes. So I love the product. And that's it. I just wanted to share the new products with you guys. So let me know if you've tried these already. And if you did, what do you think of them? As always, I have my link below. So if you want to get a percentage off of your order you can use that link below to get 20% off if you're a first time buyer of Glossier and if you guys have any questions let me know I hope you guys are having a good summer so far I appreciate you watching this video thank you for stopping by my channel if you're new here be sure to subscribe and I will see you guys soon big kisses peace love and light